From Florida to California, you can find Shona at all the top horse shows from coast to coast, providing the most reliable streaming, video services, commentary, and live show data. Can't keep up with everything? We've got you covered. This is the Shonet Weekly Wrap. Not one, but two. Shonet broadcasts its second million dollar class in seven days in the Great American Million Grand Prix at Hits Ocala. Mandy Porter was out to repeat after taking the AIG million at Thermal, but Lauren Huff and Ulala would not be denied. Their 48.966 second time held for seven riders in a 14 horse jump off. There was plenty of action throughout the week at the final show of the Hits Ocala Winter Circuit. Emmanuel Andrade opened things up with a win aboard Bolita in the welcome stake. Adelaide Tonzing rode to the top of the Hits Equitation Championship aboard Consanto. Hunter Holloway rode her veteran equitation star any given Saturday to victory in the $50,000 USHAA International Hunter Derby. And the Smart Pack Grand Prix went to Todd Minikis and Volinsky S. Shona was on the road to yet another destination when setting up shop at the 72nd annual Pin Oak Charity Horse Show in Katy, Texas. You can find just about everything at Pin Oak, including top show jumping. There was a pair of Pin Oak Charity Grand Prix classes. The $25,000 class was won by Christian Heineking and NKH Kalango, who also topped the welcome stake. The $30,000 event went to Lockenbar and Matt Seifert. Keely McIntosh shined in the under-25 Grand Prix with Jennifer Booth's Goofy Van Overis. And the veteran pair of Bowie and Courtney Calcanini were victorious in the USHJA International Hunter Derby. Circuit rolls on at the World Equestrian Center. Sam Pegg and Shia De Macheco won the welcome stake. Michaela Weber got the better of Pegg in the Futures Prix with her own Donald and Dean. And the WEC Grand Prix was won by Andrea Simpson and her own Vendome DHZ. Not one, not two, not three. Shonet streamed five Grand Prix classes and two International Hunter Derbies this week in three different states. And we're just getting started. We'll have more in the next weekly wrap.